Hey, what is up everybody? It is AJ here and in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to clear your cache in Microsoft Teams. If your Microsoft Teams has been acting up, say you're missing a join button, your calendar, things like that, clearing your cache is one of the first troubleshooting steps I'll take to try and resolve the issue. One tip to know though is that once you do clear your cache, if you've got things like custom backgrounds installed, these may be removed so you just have to add them back in afterwards. But with that being said, let's jump on the computer and learn how to clear our cache in Microsoft Teams. The first thing you want to do is close out of Microsoft Teams as well as all other Microsoft Office programs. In Teams, you can right click in the taskbar and then go close window. But what you have to do is also go into the bottom right hand corner, select on the up arrow, find the Teams icon and right click again, and then go quit. This is going to fully shut down Microsoft Teams. Then make sure you do the same for all other programs like Word, Excel, PowerPoint. Just make sure there's no Microsoft Office programs to avoid any sort of interference. Once you've closed all your Microsoft Office programs, you want to go into your File Explorer, and then we're going to search for the Microsoft Teams cache. I'll put this in the description down below, so you can just copy and paste it, but we're basically going to search for the app data. If you want to type this in yourself, you can follow along with me by selecting on your home and then typing in percent app data percent backslash Microsoft. This is going to take you to the app data or the cache for basically all of your Microsoft programs. Then we're going to go down and find Microsoft Teams. You're going to simply right click on Microsoft Teams and then you're going to just choose to delete this. But first, let's actually have a look at the properties. You can see here that I have over 2.3 gigs of data in my Microsoft Teams cache. So when I delete this, there are a few things that will have to be re-downloaded and manually added because this has about two or three years worth of information on it, but that's okay, I can add it in after. I'm simply gonna go right click and then delete. And you've now deleted your cache from Microsoft Teams. If you want to, you can go ahead and empty your recycling bin, but this would have cleared your cache. And there you have it, it is that easy to clear your cache in Microsoft Teams. Let me know in the comment section down below if this fixed the issues you were having. Of course, if you like this video, let me know by giving a thumbs up and if you want to supercharge the way is your computer, hit that subscribe button as well. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.